So let's go with each of our panelists and see how much you're willing to pay for Ashwin. I'm going to start with GS. Surely GS is going to tell us how much he's going to be, uh, pay for Ashwin at this auction. Yes. Uh, I think between five and seven. Hmm. Okay, you're going to say between five and seven. Now I'll, I'll give you the brackets: two to four, four to seven, or over seven. Right. So you're going to four go to, four seven. to seven. All right. Fair enough. So four to seven for Gaurav Sundar Raman. Uh, Akash, how much for Ashwin? Same, four to seven. I won't touch seven for Ashwin. Okay, uh, Dan. Seven. Exactly seven. All right. It it fits in four to seven then, even though Dan Vijori is going a bit higher for it. Naga. Six. Okay, so that also falls in between four to seven. Yeah, I think even four and seven is a fairly big margin. Yeah. To... <laughs> it is a huge margin. Oh, seven for someone. Ask, ask the Mumbai Indians whether three crore will make a difference to their kitty. Uh, but yeah, it's fair to say Ashwin is likely to fall in that four to seven bracket. So I'm with everybody else on this. Uh, four to seven for our Ashwin is where we're going, whether he comes in first in that market set or a bit later on. We could be completely wrong here, but we'll find out at the auction. Suresh Raina. Very interesting pick. Out of the playing 11 for CSK in what was considered his comeback season and whatnot. As, uh, C and the man who replaced him won them the title. Now, Raina comes in fairly early as well. He's in the, the first set of battles. That's set number two. Along with the likes of Devdar Padikal and Manish Pandey. Uh, so, some decent names in that already. How much are we willing to pay for a Suresh Raina whose base, base price, of course, uh, is the same? It is uh, at 2 crore. Uh, let's start with Akash Chopra for this one. Akash, how much for how much for Raina? Mm, two crore. Okay, base price. It is a ten if team. Get, if, if, if he gets sold, if he gets sold, that is. All right, so that's two crore base base price. Uh, Dan has already put two up, so we can almost copy paste that. Uh, producers doing a great job of keeping of keeping up with us. So base price two crore. Uh, yes, how much for Raina? Four. Okay, uh, four crore. Naga. Three. Three, right. So two to four. Yeah, that's where that's where GS is. GS says two crore, and Naga also says two two crore. Yeah, you know what? I I if there is a player who's likely to be passed in that set, it's going to be Raina. Not that he won't get a franchise, whether or not in that set or in the accelerated, he will get a team. Given it's ten teams, I would have been very curious to see if he gets a team if it was still an eight team auction, but. I'm gonna go with that. I'm gonna go for I'm gonna go for two to four because I think there'll be a little more than two spent for a Suresh Raina because he's coming that early. So that's what we've got. Uh, and you of course, everyone unsold. Is... Sorry. I thought you said unsold. I I I I thought he'll get passed. He could get passed and picked up later. I do I don't think he'll go unsold at the end of two days. But it would not surprise me if teams hold on with every crore mattering in those first thirty players. I think they'll hold on. And see, but somebody is obviously going to try and nick him off at base price there. So anyway, we'll see how that goes. Bhuvaneshwar Kumar, what an interesting player to try and figure what his value will be at this auction. Two crore is his base price. Akash, four crore. Mm -hmm. Dan, uh, six. Okay, six crore for Bhuvi. Decent money there. GS. Yeah, around the same bracket, five to seven. Five to seven. All right, Naga. Just making up brackets now. <laughs> <laughs> Naga. Same thing. Four. Four, is it? You know what? I, I'll I'll give Movie a little more over here now. I know I, I don't think he's the player he was like everyone else, but I think he's gonna go for a bit more. So I'm gonna I'm gonna stick to a little over seven. There's gonna be some players gonna inflate it. There are not a lot of experienced Indian fast bowlers. And therefore, I'm going to go for more than seven. Just, just touching seven, seven point one. So a little over seven crore. Okay, Ambati Raidu, interesting. Two crore base price. Uh, let's change. Let's go to Dan first up. How much for Raidu, Dan? Uh, six, four to seven. Okay, four to seven. Akash. I'm, I'm underestimating everything. I'm like, uh, <laughs> am I like the frugal buyer? I'll say four crore. That's it. Four crore for Raidu, all right. Uh, GS? Four to seven. Four to seven. Uh, Naga? Yeah, four to six times. Yeah. Four, four, okay. four. Go for four. So, you know, he, he interestingly features in the wicket keeper set. That's set number four. And he's going to be alongside Ishan Kishan, Nicholas Puran, Dinesh Karthik, uh, Matthew Wade coming off, you know, a, a pretty high profile tournament. So, you never know. Whether that affects Raidu's price in any way, it's a bit late. Yeah, so I'm I'm gonna go lower as well, two to four for Ambati Raidu. 
I think it'll be a steal actually. Someone gets him in two, three, could still play. All right. Use Vendra Chahal. Big one. Let's go with Dan Vittori first time. How much are you willing to pay for UZ? Dan. Uh, I, I want to say 10, but I'll go, I'll go eight. Eight crore. All right. So that's a big one. Yeah. Uh, seven crore plus for Dan Vittori then. So eight. That's another big one, isn't it? Seven crore plus is uh, <laughs> could go for anything. It could be 15, 16. Akash. Same, same. About uh, seven and a half, eight. Seven and a half, eight. GS? Ten plus. Ten plus. All right. He's, he's making his brackets as he tends to. Gaurav Sundaraman. Uh, Naga? Uh, eight. All right. Eight for Naga. This is set number six where he pops up. Yuzvendra Chahal along with the likes of Rahul Chahal and Amit Mishra, Kuldeep Yadav too. Yeah, I think he'll touch ten crore. So, I'm going to go ten crore for Yuzi Chahal. I want, to change, I want to go to 10. Put, put, to put me at 10 as well. <laughs> all right. All right. So, get the wood Dan at 10 as I well. Mean, so I mean, 10, 10 crore is <laughs> 7 plus only. It's all right. Seven yeah, plus seven plus. Plus. It's anyway, 7 plus. <laughs> but we're more, we're more plus than you guys are, right? So, that's the game we're playing now. Rabada. Yeah, you man, you go mad if he was you. Rabada in the marquee set. All right. Dan, hey, how much? Uh, I will say 6. Six. Okay. I wonder if that's on the lower side for some of the others, whether that's fair. Uh, Akash, Kagi Surabada. Eight. 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 All right. So that's seven plus for Akash. Yes. Ten plus. Ten plus. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. yeah. You've not put him in the most expensive when you're putting ten plus. <laughs> yeah. Still, there might be more people above eleven, maybe. Who knows? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Strange things happen. He's in the mark. He said he could come up first for all. You know. Naga, yeah, even if two players go behind her, but uh, two teams go behind her, but uh, his price is going to go up. So that's all you need. That's all you need. You need yeah. just two teams to, to build up a price. Yeah, yeah, eight. yeah, eight to ten. Eight to ten. Yeah, I'm convinced he's going for over ten. I'd be staggered if he goes for anything less than ten. So ten plus for me for Kagi Surabada. All right, Dwayne Bravo. Hmm. The stalwart from CSK, still the high base price, retired from international cricket. Dan Vittori, how much are you paying for him? Two crore. Is the best price. Yeah, I'm just doing my best my bets here. Four to seven. Four to seven for Bravo, right, Akash? Base price. Base price. All right. Dwayne Bravo, who's gonna come in that third set in the all-rounders. Uh GS. Akash, you're not going to be spending your full money, it looks like. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. I'll, 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 I'm the Rajasthan money ball team. I actually save money. <laughs> Yes. It's logical, but I doubt it will happen. But yeah, uh, Bravo is four to seven. Four to seven. Just to give you guys some context, uh, Shakib in that set, Hasaranga in that set, Jason Holder, Mitchell Marsh, Mohammed Nabi, Krunal Pandya, Harshal Patel, Nitish Rana, and Washington Sundar. That is a power packed all round set, right? So good luck to see who you want to pay good money for. Harshal Patel's put his name as an all rounder, remember? So keep that in your calculations. Naga, how much for Bravo? Base price. Base price. Yeah, I think after I've read that list in that he's in, I'm just going to say base price because you're, you're willing to put a lot more money to some of the other players in that. So, if anything... There's, Bravo, not, there's not 10 all-rounders there. So, not everyone can so, have them. Say that again, Dan? I said there's there's, there's 10 franchises. So, not every, not everyone's going to get their a player from that set. So, yeah. someone will want Bravo. Chino yeah, will, yeah. Chino will bid for him. Yep. <laughs> David Warner. Two crore is the base price in the marquee set. Three franchises looking for captains. Right, Dan. David Warner, give us a price. Ten. Ten crore. All right. Akash? Ten plus, yeah. Ten, Ten plus. plus, all right. Ten plus for Akash as well. GS? Finally. Ten plus. See, I spend. I spend. I spend. <laughs> Ten plus. Naga? <laughs> when it's not mine. Naga, how much? Ten. Ten. All right. Ten exact. Okay. I'll... I'll go for I'll go for ten plus as well. Given that nine franchises may well be interested in him, nine, right? Okay, uh, Fav Duplessis, two crore the base price. He's in the marquee set as well as the former South African captain, uh, Dan. Well, yeah, we never discussed him as a captaincy option as well. I think he could he could fit that mm. bill. So I would say he would be seven plus. Seven plus. All right, Fav still very fit uh, at this stage, even though he is uh, what thirty seven now. Thirty nine. 37, 37. Yeah, 37. 84 bonds. So 38 this year. So that's what we've gone with Fab Duplessis. Uh, Akash, how much for Fab? Uh, I'm going conservative. Four. Four. Akash, it might be snapped up by Rajasthan Royals before the auction. <laughs> 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 
Like, let's get you in to save our money. Yes. Uh, I'm tempted to go seven, seven plus, but I think I'll stick to four to seven. Four to seven. Okay. Naga? Yeah, the same, four to six, five. Yeah, you know what? I would have said four to seven in a normal year, but 10 team option again, there's lots of room. There are not so many great overseas players that you're going to put for. So I'm going for seven plus. Fab Duplessis is going to surprise people. He's got a gun fielder still, more than handy at the top. He's transformed as an IPL player. So I'm, I'm seeing Fab go for good money. He's coming in at the top. Trent Bolt to round up this. So let's ask his compatriot. Dan, how much for Bolt? Uh, he's just had his third kid, so he needs seven plus. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great justification okay. in an auction. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm thinking, yeah, oh, well I need done. another kid to get seven crore. Okay. Well done. Well done. Well That's done. I don't get seven crore. Okay. Eight Akash. plus. Eight plus. Kagi, so same, same, almost. So seven same plus value. then. Seven plus eight, in that. Eight, yeah, whatever. Eight, whatever. Yeah. Yeah. GS. Yeah, seven to ten. I can say seven plus. Yeah. Seven to ten. All right. Naga? Six. Six. Okay. So he's in the four to seven bracket. Gee, I'd like for Bolt to go bigger, you know, even more than 10. But yeah, I think he'll just nick below that. So I'm still going to say 7 plus, though. I'd see him going for more than 7. Plus. 